Gotta make sure this area over here is nice and clean, and I am working at the Brookhaven Records as a janitor, guys. Okay, clean up over here. Miss the spot in here, okay? Being a janitor is no easy work, guys, but it's a good job, and it pays pretty well, and I am happy to be working, bro. As you guys can hear, there's actually an artist in the studio right now, and, and there's my boss, Mr. Records, and some artist in there. I actually don't know who that guy is, but he looks like he could be famous. Wait, and they just stopped playing, and my boss just said, nice! Oh, and the artist just came out, and he said, I think that was the one. Guys, how cool would it be to be a big, famous artist like this guy? Then they got these silver and gold plaques on the wall. How cool would it be to have your face on one of those? Wow. Like I could see it now, but I'm not a musician guys. I'm just a janitor. Wait, my boss just said Todd come over here Uh, yeah, yes, mr. Records guys. I don't think I've ever met anyone famous before he said I have someone I'd like you to meet This is Kyle with three E's at the end. Uh, yeah, I guess you guys everyone's gotta have their thing. What's up, bro? I'm Kyle. He's going to be the next big superstar. He said, Mr. Records, you're too nice. But yeah, I know, LOL. Guys, you could hear his music earlier. It was actually pretty good. Okay, well, I gotta go. Superstar stuff, you know? Um, no, I, I, I wouldn't know, bro. I'm literally a janitor. Like, I, I clean up after this guy. Mr. Records said, of course. See you later, Kyle. Yeah. Guys, the three E's is. I wonder what the heck that stands for. All right, guys. Well, now that Kyle left, I'm just gonna get back to work. You know, I want Mr. Records to think I'm doing a great job around here. He actually just says, so, Todd, this place is super clean great work thank you mr records honestly i appreciate it i i really try hard to make sure that the place is clean and you know that you're you're paying me for hard work so uh mr records i actually have a question for you like if someone wanted to get into you know the music industry like how how would they do that like how much does it cost to like use the studio here it's like i'd love to learn how to make music but i, I don't want to play any instruments or anything he said oh it's only 10k an hour dang bro it would take me for ever to be able to afford just one hour of this place he said however if you show some real talent we might be able to do it for free i'm gonna head out see you tomorrow okay bye mr records i'll make sure the place is nice and clean before you get here tomorrow have a good night guys and there he goes guys i'm so grateful for mr records letting me work here and you know it's really really cool i get to see these cool famous people who are good at music and you know i've always wanted to go in and try out the microphone myself and maybe play the piano over there and the drums but i don't want to get in trouble and i'm probably not any good at it anyways final touches i'm just gonna clean up over here yep okay looking good get in here okay okay have a sip of cola and done the place looks pretty clean to me guys okay well i'm gonna head home okay okay i'm gonna turn off all the lights guys okay and make sure i lock the door when i leave boom all right guys time to go home oh i've been working so hard all day i cannot wait to go to my bed currently i'm actually staying over at the motel i don't have a place to stay right now i'm actually just kind of struggling with some money and everything like that but things are going pretty good at brookhaven records so i think that there's a good chance i maybe make some more money soon i don't know uh fine Finally, guys, I'm back in my motel room. I am exhausted, though, so I'm just gonna go right ahead, lock the door, get into bed, and, uh, can't wait for work tomorrow. What the heck did those three E's stand for? Okay, gotta make sure the toilet is clean, and boom. I gotta make sure the sink is clean. Hey. Whoops, okay, and the bathroom is finished guys it's looking pretty good just another day working at Brookhaven records guys as a janitor And I think actually mr. Records is over there with Kyle with three E's again So I'm gonna try and stay out of their way, but he actually just said Kyle your newest song is off the charts You're about to get your first gold record. Whoa, that's so cool. Nice. I knew I would be famous Oh, well, um uh, Kyle's kind of got a little bit of an ego, guys. Um, but, you know, he is about to get his first gold record, so that's pretty cool, bro. Man, I've never even played one of these instruments before. I've been too scared. Mr. Records said, we gotta get your album out ASAP. This will be amazing. Kyle just said, yeah, album would be sweet. It'll probably make me richer and cooler than ever, too. Guys, is, is this just me, or does Kyle really only care about his image versus like his music he said so how about we work on the album tonight guys i feel bad i'm like kind of like eavesdropping on their conversation right now but i'll just stick to cleaning kyle actually said nah i got stuff to do later though guys kyle with three e's honestly is hilarious bro like this guy he doesn't even care about making music like he just wants to be famous and all this other stuff but bro like i love music like oh if i could learn how to play music and make good music like who knows i could secretly be really good at music wait 
Kyle just stood up and I think he's about to leave. And Mr. Record said, Kyle, we really need to work on this. The sooner we get the album out, the better. I said, bruh, everyone loves me. I ain't no St. John. Who the heck is St. John? Oh, and there he goes, guys. They just left again. Okay, guys, well, if I was Mr. Record, I probably wouldn't be too happy about my artist not wanting to make music. Like, that's the whole reason he pays him. Well, Mr. Record's on the phone right now, so I'm just gonna make sure that I get this place nice and clean for him. I, I don't want to stress him out anymore because, you know, Kyle with three E's, that guy clearly doesn't want to do any work. But not me, bro. I'm gonna work my butt off around this place. You know, I got bills to pay and a life to make. He said, Todd, I need to take this BRB. Oh, okay, Mr. Record, sounds good. And guys, if anyone notice how short Mr. Record is, like... I don't want to say anything to him, but that guy's pretty short. Okay, and I'm gonna go in here, make sure everything is fine, and... Oh, dang, those drum sets actually look pretty dirty, bro. Like, I'm gonna try and clean those up real quick. Okay, hold on. Okay, guys, I've never done this before, but let me give it a try. <gasps> I did it! Oh, that was actually pretty cool. Oh, no way, guys. Ah, I'm playing the drums! <laughs> I'm tired of playing the drums. Dang, bro. I actually could be pretty good at this if I practice. <gasps> there he is. Oh, my God. He almost caught me. Okay, guys. I don't want Mr. Records to see that I was playing the drums. But that was so much fun, guys. I can't wait. Maybe every night after Mr. Record leaves, I could practice the drums and get better and better. And maybe some other instruments, too. Who knows? Maybe one day, I could get a gold plaque myself. How cool would that be? But... I'm never gonna be a superstar like Kyle with three E's. Like, that guy's so cool. Man, a gold record one day, bro. But for now, I guess I'm just gonna have to keep cleaning these floors. Mm. All right, guys. Well, I gotta go head into work as a janitor soon. And wait, breaking news. What the heck's going on? It would appear the superstar Kyle with three E's had a severe meltdown on stage last night after his album flopped. You can see the video on my YouTube channel at jboblo at ut. Oh my god, guys. Kyle with three E's had a meltdown at his first concert because his album didn't perform as well as he was hoping. Uh-oh. All right, guys. I better get into work because I bet Mr. Records really needs my help today. Um, guys, I'm... Walking into work right now, and all these Channel One news vans are here. I, I don't know why. There's actually a newsman right there. I'm just gonna try and walk right by, and he just said, "Sir, can we ask you some questions?" Uh, I don't, I don't think my boss would like that very much. Wait, wait, he just said, "Did you like the new Kyle album?" And did you see his meltdown? What the heck? I'm not, I'm not answering that. Uh, 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 no, I haven't heard the album yet, and uh. Yes, I saw he had a meltdown. Wait, he said, you heard it here first, folks. Employees of the Brookhaven Records don't even like the album. Hey, bro, that's not what I said. I said I haven't even heard it yet. He said, cut. Hey, bro, what the heck? You trying to get me fired for my job? He said, that is what you said. Nah, no, it's not, bro. All right, whatever. I gotta get to work. Like, dang, bro, I don't want Mr. Records to see that and get mad at me. Wait, Kyle's here. And so is Mr. Records. And he said, this is all your fault. My album was bad. Mr. Records said, Kyle, what happened to you? Oh, guys, maybe I should just, uh, yep, start cleaning. I'm just gonna mind my own business over here. Yep, act like I'm, uh, cleaning this plant. Yep. Wait, wait, wait. Kyle just said, I'm the best artist on Earth. They just don't see my vision because they're, 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 they are all, you're all done. He said, you're dumb. That janitor is dumb. Hey, bro, Kyle, I didn't do anything to you. He said, you would never have a superstar like me again. He said, hey, Todd did nothing. Leave him out of this. Yeah, bro. Hey, thanks, Mr. Records. He said, nah, this record labels for losers. I'm out. Kyle just said, what did you think of my album, bro? First off, you just called me dumb. Like, you're like, yeah, I don't like hit you in this face with my mop. I didn't hear, bro. Like, I didn't listen to it, okay? He said, LOL, yeah, duh, you're a janitor. What would you know? No, he's leaving, bro. Like, what the heck? Kyle is a diva. Well, guys, you know, Kyle's career was definitely short-lived, that's for sure. That's what you kind of get for being a jerk and, you know, not really focusing on your craft, bro. Oh, I see Mr. Records over there. I hope he's not taking it too hard, bro. And I want to go see what he's actually up to. Wait, he's hopping on the piano. Oh, my God. Is he, is he crying? Bro, Kyle must have really broken his heart or something. Like, what the heck, Kyle? Like, you made, you made Mr. Record cry. He's like, Kyle, why? Oh, poor Mr. Records. No, like, oh, excuse me, Mr. Records, I'm cleaning. That was beautiful, Mr. Records, and uh, I'm sorry about Kyle with three E's. Like, you don't need that guy anyways. He said, oh, hey, Todd, thanks. Yeah, of, of course, Mr. Records. Like, you're gonna find another superstar in no time. You know, it's it's all gonna be okay. He said, whatever, there's only one Kyle. And now he's running to the bathroom crying, bro, no. Oh, poor Mr. Records. Well, guys, Mr. Records is in the bathroom, and... I gotta keep cleaning up. I gotta get in this room again. 
And there's the drum set, bro. Like, I actually really want to try the drums again, but Mr. Records is in the bathroom. This whole room is pretty soundproof, though. Like, I don't, I don't think he'd be able to hear me anyways. Okay, just, just a quick beat. Ah! Bro, this is so cool. Like, I've actually been practicing for a month now. Hey, look, bro, I'm getting sick with it. Hey, bro, look how dope this is. Like, I'm getting so much better than I was when I first started. Hey, I'm... It's a lot easier the more you practice and... Oh, oh Mr. Record! Oh, sorry, Mr. Record. I, I didn't mean to be doing that, bro. He said, Todd, since when did you learn how to play instruments? He said, have you ever made a song before? Uh, no, I've never made a song before or anything like that. Like, I just sometimes practice the drums. I, I don't really know if I can sing or anything. He said, hey, give me the mop and go get in the booth. Hey, you just took the mop from me, bro. You want me You want me to go in the booth? Like, okay, I guess. Because that red light just turned on. I think that means we're recording. He said, go ahead and try singing to this. Ooh, I like this. Man, I need a cola, need a cola right now, yeah Man, I need a cola, need a cola right now, I swear it's Summertime, I need a cola right now Every day of the year, I need a cola right now What? Todd, get out here now! Oh, uh, jeez guys, I didn't think it was gonna be that bad I knew I should've never came in here in the first place, dang it! He's gonna hate me now. He's gonna hate me because I make bad music. You're, you're stupid, Todd. You should have never touched those drumsticks. You should have never went in there and sang on the song. He said, Todd, why didn't you ever tell me? Tell you what? That I, that I was using the drums without your permission? I'm sorry. I know it's stupid of me. That you're amazing at music? Actually? Wait, you actually think I'm good at music? He said, yeah, we need to get a single recorded and published yesterday. You're gonna be a superstar. Way bigger than Kyle with three E's ever was. You mean it? Wait, does that mean I can get my own silver and gold record one day? So let's get you in that booth. Let's do it, bro. Okay, grab a cola, getting ready to go. Nice, all right, bro. Time to get to work, guys. As you can see, I am no longer living in the motel. I am actually living in the apartment right below the music studio, bro. Yes, I've been able to save up so much money from actually being an artist and not a janitor to where I can afford the apartment below the music studio. It's sick. I can go up there anytime I want. Pretty much spend like all day here anyways, just working on getting better at music and hanging out with Mr. Record, trying to just be the best artist I can be. And if you guys see over here, I've actually already gotten my silver record. My first song, Cola With The Dream, was super successful, but I'm working really hard to get my first gold record next. I'm actually just gonna sit over here and work on a new song. I've been learning how to play the guitar lately, bro. It's actually pretty sick. Uh-huh. Wait, what the heck, guys? Is that Kyle with three E's? Uh, I haven't seen that guy in a couple months, bro. Kyle, what do you want? He said, I came here to tell you I heard your new artist and he's trash. He said, no way, LOL. Is this him? He said, the janitor is your new artist? And he's laughing at me, bro. What the heck? Yeah, I'm the new artist, bro. And I work 10 times harder than you ever have here. He said, work hard, LOL. You don't work hard when you're a superstar like me. Yeah, buddy, no wonder your album flopped. It's because you never actually work, bro. <laughs> I hate to say it, I finally heard your new album. It was mid. Mid, LOL? Mid? He said, yeah, I have deals from record labels all over town. You'll see. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's cool, Kyle. Um, But I, I like, cool. Like, I don't really care, bro. Like, I, I want you to succeed. Like, that's the difference between me and you. Like, I'm rooting for you, bro. Like, you just want to see me lose. He just said, good luck with the janitor. Now he's leaving again, bro. Dang, Kyle with three E's has issues. Whatever, bro. I got music to make. I ain't letting that guy get to me. Like, come on, Mr. Records. Let's go work on that album. He said, sounds good to me. Five more listens. Three more. <sighs> okay. Uh, how many now? Do we make it yet? Come on. Tell me. He said, congrats. One million listens. Bro, I did it. I finally just got my first gold record. Bro, and it's all thanks to Mr. Records. Woo, bro, I'm gonna have a celebratory cola. Let's go, one million listens? Oh, guys, I never thought this day would come from being a janitor in this place to literally getting over a million listens, bro, and a gold plaque and a silver plaque. Next, I just need that platinum plaque, bro. Wait, guys, Mr. Records is literally pulling out the laptop. He's checking to see how many views I got again. He said, whoa. He said, Todd? Uh, what is it, bro? Guess how many listens you have now? How many? Uh, 1,500,000. 
Uh, one million and ten? Over two million? What? It was just a million, like, f what? It was like a, what? It was like a million just a minute ago. He said, wait, let me refresh again. Yeah, maybe it's an error. He said, over, he said, over three million now? Are you kidding? Wait, let me see that. Wait, are you kidding? Let me see that. He said, wait, no, five million. Oh my God, guys, my album is blowing up. He said, your listens are going up one million per minute. One million a minute. Oh my God, guys. Let's go, bro. I did it. Oh my God, who would have thought? I've literally already earned like five gold records now. Now what's going on outside, guys? Oh my god, look at all those news cars! I gotta go on the roof to get a better view! Bruh, look at all those news vans down there waiting for me! Wait, I'm getting a phone call. Hello? Drake? Uh, no, I can't come to Canada right now! You wanna do a collab album? Uh, you're gonna have to talk to my agent, bro! Speaking of, my agent's gone! Sorry, I gotta go! Hello? The record label wants to offer me how much? A <gasps> hundred million dollar contract! I did it! Woohoo! Wow, guys, it has been one year since my album has dropped and it has changed my life completely, bro. I actually just bought this house pretty recently. It's literally the biggest house you can buy in Brookhaven. It's literally the estate. My second album's coming out soon and oh my god, everyone in Brookhaven has just been so excited. Uh, to the studio, sir. Guys, my uh, limo driver is literally driving in the middle of the road right now. I think he thinks I'm literally like the president or something, but... Guys, I can't wait to get in the studio today. I got so many great ideas for the songs I'm gonna make. Oh, that place is awesome. And guys, we've been at this red light for so long and... Wait a second. Wait, stop the car! Driver! Wait. I swear to God, guys. That's Kyle with three E's! We'll play music for money. He said, can you spare some change? Are you Kyle with three E's? He said, yeah, have you heard of me? feel so bad for him guys like his album flopped now he's literally homeless he's playing music on the street for money he said wait you look familiar oh my god you're todd guys i still don't think he's realized that i'm the janitor that was working in the office when he was famous he treated me like crap add me to your next album it would really help guys of course because i'm up now this guy wants me to help him out but he didn't like my music and he didn't like me when i was just a janitor so you know what bro like nah i'm all good bro here you can have some money nah sorry bro you can't be on the album but bro good luck with everything all right i said only three bucks yeah bro it's all i got on me okay geez like be appreciative guys don't be like kyle with three e's okay let that be a lesson work hard and be nice to everyone you never know whose help you're gonna need one day all right to the studio. Time to make some bangers!